Hi everyone! So it's like 11.30 at night now and I'm just about to get ready for bed. It's a mosquito flying around. And a couple of you guys asked me um, do a She thinks she's still small enough to be a lap dog. <laughs> okay, so what I'm trying to really talk about is um, just how I close my night, I guess. Um, you know, after you've had like a long day or whatnot. Just, it's good to wind down any way you can. Sometimes I listen to music. Sometimes I have a beer or wine. Or sometimes I like really appreciate these moments I have to myself. Which is why I like staying up later than everybody else lately. Usually I sleep really early when I had school, but now it's like I really like the silence. I really like all the sounds I'm hearing and just like the refrigerator, the ticking of the clock, the snoring of my dog. It's all very peaceful to me, very calming. So you guys asked me how I sleep at night or get ready for bed. I just wanted to say that in general I am an introvert. Um, I like to look at things in retrospect and I like to keep all my emotions inside. Like I feel like I'm living inside me, I guess. So I like to do a lot of thinking, um, you know, try to do the best that I can throughout the day. But no one's perfect. So if you make mistakes, or if you do something that, you know, you wish you could have done different, then all you gotta say is, it's alright. It's okay. You did your best, and you acknowledged what you did, that you could do better with. I think that's the best thing you can do for yourself. Really. You just keep that thought in your mind. That... You did the best that you can today. So there is tomorrow to do it better, to make a difference, to make a change. I know it's not easy for some people to automatically make a change the next day. And that's okay. As much as we want to save time and just, you know, just get on that bull and ride it and, and say, Woo, I did it. Those moments are great too. Some things are just more delicate, and some things do take time. And I think that's just what we need to understand. That some things that take time, it's okay. Be patient with it. Be patient with yourself. I never want to push myself too hard, I guess. Like, I love putting myself to, 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 to do some challenges. You know, but also try to be gentle with yourself because if if it doesn't turn out the way you want it, you know, that's okay. Don't judge yourself. And don't think other people are judging you. We're all living for ourselves here. We're all here to have experiences for ourselves. It's so sad when I see people, you know, thinking too much about what other people are going to think. If anything, I feel sorry for the other people that are thinking anything about you. They're spending their time thinking about you instead of how to make themselves happy. You know? <laughs> it's getting kind of long and I'm sorry. I'm kind of getting distracted, but... It's not a meditation this time. But... I just want you guys to let go and think about the good things that happened in your day. You know, or think about the good things that happen when it happens. 
and just keep that good feeling with you throughout the day. It's like kids. We only focus on the good things, the things that excite us, things that make us want to live. When you wake up in the morning, do you start thinking of good things or bad things? Good things get you going. Bad things keep you in bed. In bed, this should not be a place for bad things to begin with, so don't ever start your day like that. <laughs> when you are in bed, do some deep breathing. Close your eyes. Relax your whole body. And start, really start searching for the good things that happened in your day today. For example, let's start with me. My mom came in this morning and woke me up. It's always such a pleasure. I had a nice quality conversation with my sister over breakfast about love. Like the five faces of love. I learned something new today. Oh, I got the I got the energy to make lunch for people besides myself. And usually I never do that when I have school, so that's great. I made the effort to do something for other people. And it was a really good lunch. Fried plantains, tofu patties. What else did I have? Oh, that's it. And let's see. Oh, I made a video earlier. Made some jewelry. Talked with my sister's friend about whatever. And it... Just, I just kind of practice being comfortable, I guess, with other people that are strangers and, you know, being comfortable with welcoming them into my house as guests. Because when you were younger, oh, that's another story. <laughs> but yeah, it was cool. So I was pretty proud of myself. <laughs> oh, my dog's snoring. You're going to hear her. <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> and yeah, I had a great day. And tonight, I had like a jamming session with my mom, which was pretty awesome. Like, it just, she just picked up her guitar. She wanted me to sing a song. I chose a song. She didn't know the, 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 she didn't have the tabs or whatever to it. So I pulled it up off the internet and she hasn't played the guitar in like many years. She read it. She played it. She had her own little riffs to it as I was singing and it was awesome. It was so cool. So random moments like that are just so awesome and that's what I live for. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to live for for the most part. <laughs> See the kind of mood you just put me in right now by talking about this? This is the kind of mood you'll get into when you start thinking about these things in your head over and over before you go to bed. <laughs> Pretty soon you'll be smiling while you sleep like me. Sometimes I sleep like this. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, yeah, just, you know, be positive and Think of the good things, let go of the bad things. We're not here to live about bad moments. We're here to remember the good times we had and the good moments we have and shared with other people. Because we only have this one life. So we're trying to do, have good experiences, right? Yeah. Well, I better get to bed. Thank you so much for listening and I hope I helped you in some way. Sorry, I kind of just rambled on about my own life, but we all go through challenges and face struggles, but the most important thing is just, just do your best, just try your best, you know, to be a good person, no matter what, even if you're not, just know in your heart that you're trying and it'll show. So, good night, you guys. <laughs>